Hey everybody, Amazing Arguist here. Uh, this is just a quick response to Captain Awesome's re-Free Tibet video where he responds to the comments that he got on his Free Tibet video. And uh, where I feel that he largely sidesteps an uh, important issue. Sorry, I'm eating. I'm just making this while I'm eating lunch. But um, he sidesteps a very important issue, which is that Tibet was uh, an independent country up until China uh, took it through violence. Uh, and, um, you know, he, he, at the end of the video, he talks about what a terrible idea Israel was. And I'm assuming that that's because Israel was taken through violence. And, uh, you know, I think we're at the point in history where when people take land, uh, through violence and um, show that sort of imperialistic tendency as uh, as you know China has and uh, uh, we have to that extent um, I think that we need to really frown upon that and uh, any time that, that you know I would say any time within the last hundred years that land has been taken uh, from an indigenous people and given to someone else, that we need to say, no, that's not correct, because that endorses a might is right philosophy. And uh, what it basically says is if your government is powerful enough to take something, then that something rightfully belongs to you. And that has been uh, the way it's gone throughout human history. But I think that we can all agree, or at least most of us can agree, that that's the trend that should come to its conclusion in this uh, supposedly more enlightened age. Thank you.